Stephen Gaidley, who has recently died at the age of 33, joined Boyzone in 1993 after answering an advert in Dublin to audition for a new boy band. Manager Louis Walsh wanted to form an Irish version of Take That and said that Gately and fellow singer Ronan Keating immediately stood out in auditions of 150 young men. The group found major success with a cover of the Osmond song Love Me For A Reason in 1994, which reached number two in the UK charts. The craze for boy and girl bands were taking off and Boyzone's clean-cut charm, along with the clever choice of classic love songs, helped them appeal across generations. Further hits followed the following year, including a version of Cat Stevens' Father and Son and the Bee Gees' Words, and the band also enjoyed success with their own songs. But at the end of the decade, they agreed to take a break. Around the same time, Gately decided to tell his fans he was gay. Much of the appeal of boy bands was built on sex appeal and being homosexual was seen as a taboo. Gately said his Roman Catholic parents had accepted his sexual orientation four years earlier. Born in the working class Sheriff Street area of Dublin, Gately said he realised that he was homosexual when he was 15 years old. Gately pursued a solo career after Boy's Own split, but failed to reach the same heights and sunk into depression. Gately took to the West End stage, starring in musicals including Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat and Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, and appeared on the ITV1 show Dancing on Ice. In 2007, following the huge success of the Tank That Reunion, Boyzone also hit the comeback trail. Their first performance was for BBC's Children in Need that year, and fans snapped up 250,000 tickets for 10 concerts on a UK tour last summer. They went on the road again this year and a new Boyzone album had been scheduled for 2010. Stephen Gately, born on the 17th of March 1976 and died while on holiday in Mallorca with his long-term partner Andy Cowles on 10th of October 2009.